Oh yeah, sexy biscuits. Nice. Long black clothes, 3 on the Sega Master System released by Sega in 1988 and based on the movie of the same name which was released by Carol Co also in 1988 and the then final entry in the Rambo trilogy where he travels to Afghanistan to um, save Colonel Trotman who's been captured by the Soviets who are obviously fighting a war in Afghanistan at the time. Absolutely badass movie. I love it. I don't think it was that successful. Not to people turn their nose up at it, but I think it's a fantastic movie. Because it's the 80s and blowing shit up to that scale was always epic in the 80s. So anyway, uh, there are a bunch of Rambo 3 games. There's one on the Mega Drive, which is by Sega. I like that game. I like that game a lot. Then there's the ports by Ocean on the Amiga, the Commodore and the Spectrum. Obviously the Amstrad and the Terry C as well, but I've played those three. This is by Sega uh, and it uses the Light Phaser. I had the Light Phaser back in the day because I won it in a competition from the official Sega magazine which everyone was around for the 8 bits but I didn't have this but it's very much in the vein as you can see here because I have a cross here we'll explain that in a moment it's very much in the vein of uh, Operation Wolf which is why not got a light gun it's Rambo Operation Wolf it is it as good as Operation Wolf probably not anyway um, I'm playing this on my Wii for emulation obviously on my Wii so I can use my Wiimote as, I thought that was me then, but it's not, as a, a gun. However, the problem is, because you look at the bottom of the screen, hey, I think the graphics are really, really nice. Pretty much on par with Operation Wolf, although I would say that that's a better game. So you've got your score here, and you've got your life here. I feel like a teacher pointing at the whiteboard. Uh, and then you've got grenades, uh, Molotov cocktails, and that's how much ammunition you've got. And obviously you shoot shit on the screen, uh, while take an absolute hammer into a light gun game. And presumably when this is gone, you're dead. It's an 8-bit game from the 80s, so I'm guessing you don't get any continues, because why would you? But, well, hold on. Um, so, yeah, I would have been all over this as a kid. Why wasn't I? I love Rambo. I like light guns. I like light gun games. Anyway, let's get into it. However, um, for whatever reason, and it's the same when you play Operation Wolf, <laughs> using this emulator on the Wii, um, was a like, because obviously we can use it as a light gun, um, I can't fire my rockets or throw my grenades unless I have to use select for that. Or No, because we only have start, don't we? And pause was on the bloody console. I'll shut up. Fire. Right, so anyway. Now, apologies for the flashing white, uh, you know, effect. The strobing effect, if you will. If you are sensitive to flashing lights and shit, I would sincerely suggest you stop watching this now. Because it's a light gun game from the 80s that was intended to be used on a CRT TV so it's gonna do this you're gonna appear there and I know you're coming and you can shoot the rockets because of course you can I've only got right well it's not on my nunchuck this is friggin brutal that's a harsh game over screen for a fucking kids game this is brutal right so it's not on my nunchuck one or two Oh shit, because I wasn't firing. Look at, look at me. Right, I cannot use grenades. But obviously that's an emulation thing. Uh, would they prolong my death? Probably not. This is fucking brutal. I do like the title screen. And I do like the, the Wolverine-esque knife effect going on. Because, you know, just to remind you of this Rambo 3. Because Rambo 2 was on. Uh, the mass system, but it was called... Was it called Top Secret in this country? Because they don't have a Rambo license. But you knew it was Rambo. Because they told us in magazines that it was Rambo. Thing is though, as a kid, even if you knew it was Rambo, because they didn't say Rambo on the box, you used to like, oh, it doesn't say Rambo on the box, it's not a Rambo game. I'm a fucking child and I'm stupid. It's a little too sensitive. It's not quite woke levels of sensitive. But, it's pretty damn sensitive. We're talking Democrat levels of when Trump got voted insensitive. So yeah, actually, it's quite fucking sensitive. Right. 
I want to live long enough to at least know... It's like my shots aren't registering properly. Uh, can I get more health? Or more ammunition? Well, both, to be fair. Yeah, it's quite difficult to shoot them. Basically, it's memorization. That's cheap. There's nothing I can do about that. I have to go back and shoot him in the turret of the tank, and then she starts lobbing nades at me. Coming out the hole, aren't you? That was a bit of a giveaway. There's a fucking hole. There's not been a hole before, but there's a hole in the middle of the floor. I'm pretty sure you're coming out of it, you Soviet bastard. Come on, I must look at my life. I must have... Oh, there must be food. See, it probably would have been... Well, no, it would have been more accurate than the light gun. It would have been the same as this, wouldn't it? You would have had the same white flickering. I would have had grenades, but I've only got one, and I've only got one Molotov cocktail. So... Christ alive, this is hard. I don't think I saw any reviews of it back in the day. So, I don't know, you know, how well it was received. By all means, if you do, then let me know. But, Christ, this is hard. like my shots aren't really connected. I'm going to stay. I got it. I got it this time. Right, stay here. Yeah, shot your grenade and you, bitch. Right. <clears throat> Bloke. Yeah, basically you got to memorise it. If you want to stand any chance, Operation Wolf is bad. Operation Wolf on the mass system is fucking excellent. It's better than the NES version, because it's got better colour. Right, you're going to come running, aren't you? Before... the guy in the hole. Ooh! Yeah, if you had this back in the day, let me know if it was really this fucking brutal. And if that one grenade, and that one Molotov cocktail, actually made boggle difference. See what I mean? It doesn't... You want to hold it down to connect, but you can because your ammunition will be fucking extinct. See those guys there? Shooting the guys in the background and them. Wait for it. And shooting her is a pain in the ass. See? Remembering it. Didn't like this guy. See? Oh. The 14 left. No, because you're... Ooh, mother post bucket. My concern for Rambo is ra rapidly... Uh, evaporating. Because it's too fucking hard and it's pissing me off. See? I mean, obviously the accuracy... Well, you got a crosshair in the middle of the circle. It's probably an emulation thing, which is why I like to know when I had this back in the day. Was it really this brutal? And obviously, if I could fire my grenades, I really can't see... It's going to come here first. They would make that much of a difference. Because I've only got one of each. Shoot April O'Neil, because that's what she looks like. Is a pain in the ass. Right, I'm holding it down. See? He runs. He literally... He doesn't literally. He does. He runs from a fire. You're going to come down here first, aren't you? That's it. I can't take any more, but I've always wanted to play this. Ooh, hello. Um, Rambo 3 on the Sega Master System. I played some hard games when I've, you know, revisited stuff and uh, walked onto this for the first time. Um, but fuck me, this is hard. This is ridiculously hard. Anyway, it's awesome. I'd love to know what you think, especially if you had this back in the day. Could you only play I'm assuming you can only play it with a light gun, otherwise you wouldn't have to play it with the Wiimote, would you? And yeah, I'd love to know what you think. Uh, did, did you even get to the end of level one? Because I fucking can. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you later.